Hi there everyone, it's Sarah here and I have a video for you on behalf of Wild Orchid Crafts as part of their YouTube design team, The Wild Bunch. And today I have a video for you which is this week's project and it's also a tutorial tagged on at the end as well because I had a request on how I did my book binding techniques. Um, so this is just going to let you see how I made it from start to finish and uh, and it was a request from a fellow YouTuber so I'll just show you what my project is for this week. It's actually a hand bound book and what I did was um, I took some chipboard and I covered it in paper and then I embellished it with loads of Wild Orchid Crafts gorgeous flowers. Um, we've got some hydrangea petals, we've got the new cosmos flower blooms, we've got some lilies, we've got six millimeter closed rose buds. Um, what else do we have here? We've got 15 millimeter open roses and we have a little butterfly at the top here. Um, the rhinestone swirls were just from my own uh, stash as were the, the beads or the stone beads at, and glass beads at the, the binding. And this is the actual technique that a fellow YouTuber asked me to do a tutorial on. So, um, on the inside of the actual book, what I've done is instead of making it paper, which I would normally do as a little notepad, I've put vellum bags on the inside. And these are, it's kind of like a memory book, if you like. Um, I used the this chip piece that said always on the front and there's a couple of chipboard hearts, there's one at the top here and one at the bottom. Um, so there are six pages in here and each one has a, a hydrangea petal on each page. And what, what it's actually for is you can put pictures in here, you can um, stick memorabilia in here, um, gift receipts, uh, just movie tickets, you know, just things that, you know, capture your memory and what have you, and you can just have that in there. You could put more in here, um, but I've just chosen six because it does kind of sit up a little bit. Um, so that's this week's project. I hope you like it. I'm going to head into the video just now and what I'll do is I'll put in an extra bit at the end of the video because I had a bit of a, a disaster happen when I made this. So I'll let you see that right at the very end. Um, so I'm going to head into the tutorial. I'm going to try and speed this thing up again and keep this under 10 minutes. Um, so have a great weekend and don't forget to check out Wild Orchid Crafts for all your flowery needs. Check out what the girls are making on the Wild Orchid Crafts web, uh, YouTube channel. Um, loads of lovely projects being made at the moment with all the new extra design team members. Um, and here we go, I'll take you into the tutorial. Bye for now.
Okay, everyone, that's my project finished. I hope you liked the blooper at the end. What a mess I was in. I had to redo the whole project again. Um, however, I like how the second one turned out. Um, this is one of the smaller bottles of Scotch Quick Dry Adhesive. And if this has ever happened to you, leave me a comment below. It'd be interesting to know how many of these small bottles have had the lid pop off like that. Um, so until next week, until I come back with a new project, have a great weekend and I'll see you later.